go and pop up at his game and they was like joy bitch you got to look fine as hell like you got to look good so if he like don't want to talk to you whatever like you know he know he missing or whatever so i was like okay 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 you know give me up okay 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 yeah i'm gonna do that i'm gonna do that like man forget him like i'm gonna do that man like look who he missing like you know you know how girls be whatever so i did that i put on some clothes you don't know the pain i feel this ain't no game now it's for real plenty of nights there was no lights i had to watch my mama fight you guys welcome back to my channel you guys i know you guys miss me i know you guys miss me because i miss y'all but um today we're gonna do a everyday simple makeup look and we're gonna do a chit chat too because i have a lot of things to tell you guys so let me stop talking let's get into the video and yeah so i'm going to use this moisturizer and it's for dry and sensitive skin i'm going to put this on my face real quick then i'm going to do my eyebrows off camera because that takes hell of a long time so i'm just gonna do that real quick and then we're gonna get into this video for real for real okay sorry did my eyebrows they look a little ashy right now but we're just gonna let that just gonna let that be okay so you guys what's been going on with you guys Okay, let me just say this. It's really hot in here, so I'm trying to get it together, y'all. I'm trying to get it together. It is hot as crap. And so I'm getting really frustrated right now. But anyway, how have you guys been? How was your summer? Because mine's, mine's have been um what should i say it's i've had a lot of experience this summer it's been um oh wait so i used this um smashbox photo finish primer and the baby skin the maybelline instant pore eraser and i'm going to use this la girl pro concealer i mean foundation you know what i mean in the shade does it even have a oh, warm caramel but um you guys like i i have had a lot of experience today today i've had a lot of experience um this summer you guys and that's why i haven't been really filming or whatever it's just been like ups and downs i've been like really 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 legit busy like legit busy as hell like if i'm not um if i'm not in school i'm at work if i'm not at work then i am traveling if i'm not traveling then i'm legit sleep somewhere because i'm so damn tired but you guys i'm taking modeling classes okay so that's why i've been like moving not moving but that's why i've been like going back and forth from shreveport to dallas oh my god it's hot shreveport to dallas and i go there like every other weekend so until i move i move in july so yeah but um i'm so excited for that experience like I just took my acting class uh, was it Saturday Monday Sat Monday I took it Monday and that just taught me so much about myself do you hear me like I just did not know that I don't know I just didn't know that um it was so hard to act well like i knew but i was never put in that position to like act or like do stuff because he had us <clears throat> he 
he'll give us a topic and then we'll have to act it out with whoever else he picked and we had to act that shit out in front of everybody okay so this looks a little too light for my skin so i'm going to use the coffee one i'm just going to mix it up because I can't be out here looking like a ghost bitch But yeah, though, he had us, um, he had us acting out a topic or whatever that he wanted us to do. And I was, like, so bad at it. Like, I sucked the balls. Literally. And then he'll have, like, one, he ha he'll have each one of us coming up at, um, He'll have each one of us coming up at once and he'll interview us or whatever. So it was bad as hell. Like, I'm not really good at talking in front of people, as you can see, because I mean, it's nobody here, but I know that I am talking to a lot of people right now. Well, not a lot of people, but I'm talking to people that are going to watch this. So it's just like, I don't know. I need to get better at that, you know? Because that's just one of the things that I'm not really good at. So, yeah. I need to work on that. But it is what it is, I guess. Concealer in the shade tan. But, you guys, okay, so what? what do you do? if you like someone and i'm not i'm not meaning like like someone like you guys like that's my freaking baby you hear me like it's just i can be mad and like when he gets on the phone it's just or we see each other in person it's just he makes me so happy like i can't even be mad at him or anything around him if you know what i mean like i don't know and he's such a sweetie pie like that's my baby you hear me that is my freaking baby i don't care what nobody say but you know like i am i'm taking it whoa hold on i'm taking it like really slow with him because i don't want it to be like we started talking and we didn't know anything about each other you know because a lot of people like to move so fast and you'll end up in a relationship with them and don't know shit about them and that's not okay that's not good so yeah but he's so sweet though like y'all this might sound crazy but i went on my first date this light is just okay i went on my first date no bullshit like i went on my first day i've never went on a date before and when i got to dallas when i got to dallas it was like i just got out of my class was that it i don't know i don't know which day it was but i just got out of my class and he was like you want to go to waffle house and i was like sure go to waffle house and the thing about it is it's crazy because I don't know what to do on a date because I've never been. Like, I guess, I don't know. But that's the funniest thing. I told him while we were eating, I said, I don't know what to do on a date. And he was like, just eat. And I was like, but I, mean, I guess he was right. I guess you just eat. I mean, that's common sense, you know, just eat. But I was comfortable. I felt like I was going to be really shy and not know what to do but i mean i'm really surprised that i wasn't because it's no matter who you it's no matter who you are no matter who you are like if i like you i'm gonna get i'm gonna be shy at first or the second time but i thought i was gonna be hella shy y'all and i wasn't in he paid for my food he paid for my food i was like 
Damn, man. Okay, so I'm gonna use this Laura Mercier Mercier powder, and I'm just going to set my face. Okay, you guys, my dog has been eating the shit out of all my damn sponges. I need to clean them, but he's been eating the shit out of all of them, like. Just be pissing me off. You just be pissing me off. You know that? <sighs> but what was I talking about? Oh, yeah, my baby. But, um. You're not gonna know who he is because for some for some odd reason when you tell people who you talk to, that's when like that's when like so much shit comes out. Like it's like unnecessary shit. Like if if the person you talk to tweets a girl, somebody's gonna tell you about it. And it's like you only you and that person that you're talking to only have that understanding of how far you can go like how far you can take somebody how far you know if you want to text other people or you want to like actually talk to other people only you and that person has understanding nobody else understands what are y'all like you know what i'm trying to say like what am i trying to say you you get what i'm saying like nobody knows y'all boundaries nobody knows y'all boundaries but you guys so people are gonna start sending you stuff and screenshots and this and that and this and that and shit pisses you off because it's like why are you sending me that like i know he talks to her okay and i'm going to use this shade of course and i'm going to contour my face so you guys <laughs> am i the only well i know i'm not the only one but you guys the the people that i've talked to like previously in the past you guys when i tell y'all they played the shit out of <laughs> they played they played the shit out of me you guys okay so this one guy when I first moved to Shreveport, we started talking or whatever, right? And we knew, well, I didn't, well, I don't think he knew me because I was lame as hell in, in high school, I would say. But, like, people knew me, but nobody knew me, you know? So, let's get this clear, baby. My, my grandma was so strict. Like, I just started going somewhere, like, in, what, my junior year, I would say. Yeah, I want yeah, my junior year I I literally just started going places, right? But anyway, um so I knew him, but I don't think he knew me exactly. <laughs> I'm gonna tell him to watch this, okay? Cuz I put this over his head like every time he tries to talk to me, I put this over his head. Like I fucks with him, like that's my that's my friend, but I mean, it's gonna take a lot for you to try to get me back to where i was at first right okay so we started talking or whatever and i went to one school and he went to the other so i used to always go see him yeah yeah, yeah whatever so out of the blue okay he played basketball so out of the blue you know he was telling me that he wanted me to come see his games come see him play for his games come see him play for his games see what i'm talking about I can't talk for a long time. Okay, so he wanted me to come see him play, right? And I was like, okay, sure, we can do that, yada, yada, yada. And keep in mind, <laughs> keep in mind he goes to another school. So cut off because it was getting too hot. But um, what I was saying was, okay, so I finally decided to go to one of his games. Okay. I'm going to tell, like, the girls who were with me that day, like, I want y'all to watch this because I hope y'all remember this shit, okay? So, okay, so I was texting him and I was telling him, like, I'm coming to the game, where is it at? Because he was playing my school at his, at his school. So I was like, okay, well, let's go to the game or whatever. Keep in mind, I'm pretty sure football and basketball players know where the hell they play it, okay? So... 
I text him and I was like, I'm coming to the game or whatever. Where's it at? Keep in mind, I knew where it was, okay? I knew where it was. I just wanted to see what he was going to say. He was like, oh, I'm not sure. My coach doesn't know exactly where it is. Keep in mind, it's the, it's the day of the game. Really? You don't know? Come on now. You, you really don't know. Okay, so I was like, like me and me and my best friend and then someone else and then someone else we were all in there just discussing and like plotting like how you don't know what a game is like what do you mean you don't know like this and that this and that and we was like oh yeah he trying to play you he trying to play you yeah yeah you know how you know how you know how we talk with him i'm not even doing my makeup okay so i'm going to use this mac um skin finish natural yeah, skin finish natural in the shade dark, and I'm just going to dust off all that powder and everything else that I did. So, um, what was I saying? Okay, so we were just talking or whatever, and we decided to go and pop up at his game. And they was like, Joy, bitch, you got to look fine as hell. Like, you got to look good. So, if he, like, don't want to talk to you, whatever, like... You know he know he missing or whatever. So I was like, okay, okay, okay. You know, get your bill. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I'ma do that. I'ma do that. Like, man, forget him. Like, I'ma do that, man. Like, look who he missing. Like, you know, you know how girls be, whatever. So I did that. I put on some clothes. I, I'ma take out. I'ma I'm gonna put the picture right here if I can find it. I wasn't looking good, but you know, back. Back then, you know, I thought I was on some shit. Okay, I'm so. I'm gonna put my lashes on. I'm gonna use these. I'm gonna put these lashes on, but I'm gonna do this off camera. But let me finish my store first because I really don't have much else to do but put these on and um highlight. But anyway, oh wait, let me contour my nose. But um. Yeah, so we went and we walked in. It was like halftime. So we was already half ass later or whatever. And we walked in and <laughs> we walked in and it was like some cheerleaders and they was bomb as hell. Like I'm not gonna even lie, they like they was cute as hell, right? So I walked in and you know, like I walked in on the side that he wasn't, you know, sitting on or whatever. So I walked in and I you know, I'm doing me like I'm doing me like I'm walking in like, hmm. yeah, you see me. And we we spotted like we we caught each other's eyes. So I'm like, mm -hmm, he see me, he know I'm him. Mm -hmm, he know I'm him. And it's like when he saw me, it was like in shock. Like it was like, this bitch really came. Like yes, bitch, I knew what the game was. I knew the time it started, and I knew who he was playing. Like yes, bitch. But you still my dude though. You still like we laugh about this now. We laugh about this now, but at that time it was like <laughs> you know, whatever. But um yeah, so I was just mad as hell at that point because you know, you knew where the game was, but you didn't want me to go. So like something had to be up. So after that, like we stopped talking obviously obviously we stopped talking and like after a while he blocked me from everything like i couldn't see shit he was doing he blocked the shit out of me y'all you know how <laughs> he just blocked the shit out of me okay so but he didn't block my best friend so this bitch found that he was in a relationship and he was dating one of the cheerleaders so we was all sitting there we was like oh so that's why he wanted to come to the cast because of course the cheerleaders gonna be there like of course like uh, duh bitch like we was putting all this together and they was they started dating like in the midst of us talking you know what i mean so you know i was a little upset about that but i mean hey it is what it is like that's still my friend that's still my friend it's just situations like that i just 
I'm real iffy about because it's like, I don't know, because, I mean, you did it once, you could have did it again, like, you could do it again, like, I don't know, you know, but they always say that they've, ooh, okay, so let me tell y'all, let me tell y'all about this another guy, okay, so we were talking, like, let me, let me get my life together, so we were talking, like, um, hold on, let me put my eyelashes on, and then we're gonna get into this video, okay, well this story so i'm not going to i just decided that i'm not going to i'm not going to um talk about that because that's just you have to know like the whole story behind it so i'm not going to talk about it i'm just gonna do that in another video because like it was really like that was like i'm gonna take this sasha buttercup and i'm just going to um i'm gonna put it right here so it can define my contour but um yeah i'm gonna do that on another video because like that one was really juicy and it's like i'm i'm almost done my makeup so i'm not gonna have time to do it or talk about it so but yeah, the moral of the story is, you guys, it's a lot of things that, <laughs> that I have been going through that, like, I don't know. Like, I think, like, the modeling and acting experience, like, that taught me so much stuff. Like, it was, it taught me so much shit that I didn't know about myself, if that makes sense, like, it just taught me a lot of stuff basically and all those people that hurt me all those people that did me bad treated me wrong like like y'all just don't know y'all just don't know y'all taught me a lot y'all taught me a lot about myself that I even didn't know so thank you It, it let me know that I can take a lot of bullshit. <laughs> a lot of bullshit. You know what I mean? Like, I can take a lot of freaking bullshit. And I'm happy that I can, you know? Like, I'm really happy that I can take a lot of bullshit. But well, hey, I mean, life's good though. You know, I can't complain. Like, I've learned that there's people that are going through worse things than I am. So that's why I don't even complain anymore. I just don't do it because I just feel like it's making it seem like I'm ungrateful for what the things that I have, you know? So, I don't even complain no more. Like, if I'm broke, I'm broke. So, if I'm broke, I'm broke. If I'm, if something bad happens to me, something bad happens to me. Like, I can't just really complain off stuff like that because of course you're gonna go through shit in life everyone does people go through more stuff than other people do so i just don't complain anymore like let me stop lying i complain but i don't complain as much you know because i used to complain so badly like well why out of all people my car broke like I don't know. Everything happens for a reason, you know. God has a plan just for you. And I do believe. I do believe that he puts you through stuff that you can handle. You know, if that makes sense, he puts you through stuff that you can handle. And that or he's teaching you a lesson of like something not to do, you know, 
that makes sense because I know when I talk for a long time I don't know I don't even know what the hell I be talking about but um yeah okay I have like the weirdest question right so I don't know if people still say I think yeah they do people do still say this okay so where in the crab did sis come from you know you know what I mean like the S I think it's S U S sis like where did that come from and I know like I think that's like another meaning for like bitch I'm like come on now bitch or come on now sis you know that's what I think I don't know for real what it means but that's what I think it means and I just wanted to know like where like where did it come from you know or maybe I'm just weird that I don't know but I'm gonna use this um Fenty Beauty highlighter in the shade well not shade I don't think it's a shade but it's fire crystal this is a highlight whoa I did not know this was a highlight as you can see like I'm been I've been using this one I didn't know it was a highlight let me see okay bitch hold on let me see let me test it out because I cut off again like I think this ring light is making it you know be really overheated but I mean it looks the same as the other one I love a highlighted nose okay like I love that shit it's so cute I forgot what I was talking about though you guys so if you see me just flip flopping in this video sorry okay I'm so sorry I like a highlighted chin too and a highlighted forehead. I don't know why. But I need um I need to organize my bag where my highlighting stuff is and my makeup. I need to fix it. Cause it's like all over the place right now. Okay, so the last thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to spray this pro spray pro spray and set I don't know I'm going to use this I'm just going to spray it on my face and whoa That junk feels so freaking good. Guys, so this is the finishing look. Basically, this is just something that I just do every day. Every, every day. This is something that I just do every day. Hell, I go out looking like this too. Like if I'm going like to a party, I will put this on too. Like if you haven't noticed, like I'm not really good at like eyeshadow. That's not my thing. I don't know how to do it. Well, I know how to do it, but I don't know how to do it, like, really good. Like, I don't know how to, like, for some reason, I don't know how to blend the colors together. That makes sense. Like, I just, I don't know. I just, I like the basic, natural look or whatever. But, you guys, I enjoyed doing this video today. Like, <sighs> today was my off day. So, that's why I was like, let me go and do this video, you know. So, um, Yeah that's about it this is the video i hope you guys enjoyed me rumbling and stumbling on my words and just talking you guys to death like this is just me like this is just i talk for days okay i talk for days but if you guys like this video please 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 give this a thumbs up like share and subscribe and if you guys want to see that story that or if you guys want to hear the story that I was getting into just give this video 10 likes <laughs>
you know how like those big youtubers be like give this video like 5,000 likes I know I'm not getting that so just give me 10 likes and bitch I would give like hell I'll probably do it anyway I'll probably make the video anyway but yeah you guys follow me on social media right here and yeah I'll see you guys in the next video okay I love you guys so 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 much peace